Hello and welcome to Hakista TV and are you old enough to know what the pager is that is so popular in the 90s and today it is commonly used in corporate settings like a major hospital where the speed and reliability of the messages are important. How? Since it is delivered by a radio frequency, it means that we can emulate it using a hack RF1 and receive it using a flipper zero. And as you can see, I have the settings right here. And on flipper zero, which is currently running on leash, what we can do is go to applications and under tools, there is a POC SAG pager. And let's just click it. Click receive message. Double check the frequency. 439.98 and this one is also 439.98 and when I click start it should be able to receive the message like this which is Hakista was here now if you want to test this out in the wild for example if you are near a hospital what you can do is you have your hack RF1 go to the looking glass like this because you need to know where the frequency where the POXAC messages what frequency it is being sent. So go to looking glass. There will be a waterfall here and check which part or which frequency of the waterfall there will be a disturbance and you can check it out just by moving that line and checking if what frequency the disturbance is happening and on your flipper zero what you can do is go to config and readjust the frequency there bear in mind that POXAC messages in hospitals are not encrypted. This is a known vulnerability that patient details are sometimes being sent with the messages. That's why I will also warn you to proceed with caution. Now, if you like this video, be sure to check, check out my other hacking videos here on Hakista TV. Till next time, my fellow Hakista.